What's going on here? Your master, Sun Li, the glorious strategist, betrayed you. He killed you to claim the power of the Emperor, my power, as his own. You are dead. Crap. I am the Water Dragon, immortal guardian of the path to the Underworld. I shepherd the dead, leading them to my holy temple in Dirge, the gateway to the afterlife. But twenty years ago, the Emperor and his brothers attacked Dirge. They burned my temple, slew my servants, and defiled my body so the Emperor could claim my power. When Emperor Sun Hai fell, I reclaimed some of my power, enough to call your spirit here. But now I am fading once more. Sun Li consumes my energy. Why would Master Li betray me, though? Your former master has long desired power to impose his will on the Empire. His plan took years to form, but the prize was too grand to let go to waste on his brother's madness. He consumes my essence to become a god, but he does not yet fully control his power. That is why I could bring you here, and why we can speak now. Ah! Oh. My strength wanes. We must act quickly. For you to fulfill your destiny, I must send you to Dirge now, while Sun Li struggles to control his newfound power. If he had planned all this, his lives have spanned years? The glorious strategist knows patience. Li has planned this for twenty years. When Dirge fell, he rescued you only because he believed you were a tool he could use. Oh, gosh. You will learn this and more, but we must move quickly. When he discovers what I have done, he will try to seal this realm and prevent me from sending you to Dirge. You're sending me to Dirge? Why? My temple at Dirge is defiled. I do not have the power to restore you to life, but I can send your spirit to Dirge, so you may cleanse the taint corrupting my holy sanctum. Ah! Hurry! If you restore the fountains of Dirge, I can restore you to life. If you do not, Master Li will become unstoppable. Seek out Abbot Song. He will help you. Restore the fountains of dirge. Restore my... Restore my power, and I will speak to you again. Oh, snap. Okay. Wow. Okay. Why is my health so low? Gem of Premonition. Yeah, yeah, what's, I don't know what that is, but let's check it out. Oh, screw it. It's over here. Okay. That is apparently not the way to go. Oh my gosh, we got demons I gotta deal with? There we go. Ooh, leveled up. Let's talk to Abbott's song. Alright, so, um... Who's that guy? I think he's Abbott Song. Becomes very helpful for us. Um, we're gonna do that. We're gonna up my health. 
Even though I think until I get out of here, I can't really do anything about that. This... this cannot be. Is it really possible? I sense the mark of the water dragon upon you. You have returned! Are you Abbot Song? I am the spirit of Abbot Song, slain many years ago by the glorious strategist. Before my death, I was the head of the spirit monk order. Your order. So you're the leader of the spirit monks? I am. I was. But I only led them to defeat and destruction. I failed in my duty to protect the water dragon, a duty I would one day have passed to you. You are a spirit monk, born here in Dirge and cleansed in the sacred fountains. You were an infant the day the Emperor and Sun Li attacked our monastery. I tried to save you from the slaughter, only to lose you to Li when he ripped you from the arms of your dying guardian. Lee claimed he was the one who saved me. I can only imagine what lies and distortions he told you about Dirge, your heritage, and his own role in events here. But now, you deserve to hear the truth. Thirty years ago, the long drought struck the land. For a decade, crops withered and died, starving people across the Empire demanded that something be done. Despite his position, Emperor Sun Hai could not alter the natural order. He demanded that his brother, the glorious strategist, concoct a plan to rectify this insult. Through Sun Li's cunning, the armies of the Emperor laid siege to the gates of Dirge. They came to seize the Water Dragon's power and her life-giving waters. What happened when they attacked Dirge? The soldiers of the Imperial Army swarmed over us, too many to count. My spirit monks fought bravely, but I knew the battle was lost. Good. I wanted you were to see beaten. All around me, my fellow spirit monks were dying. I tried to hold the attackers in bay. Oh, that's Prince you. Kin attacked me, and then Master Li cut me down from behind. The Emperor ascended unopposed, but already Sun Li and Prince Kin plotted against him. The glorious strategist was not content to watch his brother come to power. Emperor Sun Hai, ruler of the Jade Empire, stepped beyond his station and slew the Water Dragon, claiming her power for his own. His brothers tried to strike him down, but they could not know he would be so strong. Infused with the Water Dragon's power, he was now unbelievably powerful. Sun Li escaped with his life, but he left his brother, Prince Kin, to suffer the Emperor's terrible vengeance. Hmm. A spirit monk child still lived. He killed your guardian. Claiming his identity, no longer a servant of the Emperor, he abandoned his fearsome armor to become the master you thought you knew. Oh. If you and the Amulet were the key to defeating his brother, he might still claim that power. Lee disappeared with you and the Amulet, escaping the Emperor's retribution. With his newfound power, the Emperor is a taunt to his traitorous brother, bound kin spirit to the armor Lee had left behind. Oh. And Death's hand was born. Aha! Oh my gosh, that makes so much sense. I totally forgot about this little, that little bit right there. You were the last of the spirit monks. 
Sun Li saw our attempt to save you as confirmation of your importance. He believed you were meant to restore what he helped steal. He trained you to be an instrument of vengeance, an agent to succeed where he and Prince Kin had failed. But with your death, the Emperor is now invincible. Master Li has the power of the Water Dragon now? Then the glorious strategist has won. You were the last of the spirit monks, but now you are just a ghost like the rest of us. No one is left to oppose Sun Li. The water dragon still believes there is hope. You spoke with the water dragon? Of course! Only she could guide your spirit to Dirge, while all others must wander the mortal world. 